Hey everyone, in this video I will explain few solutions to fix the following error. Open up your task manager and make sure if Roblox is running in the background, then you need to close it. After that, open up command prompt. So to do that, go to search bar and type in there CMD and make sure to run it as administrator. You need to copy and paste all these commands in here one by one. These commands will clear the DNS caches. I will also leave the commands in the video description. If the last solution didn't work, then try the next one. Open up run again. Type this command sysdm.cpl and click OK. On the top, click on Advanced, then click on Settings. Over here, select this option, Complete Memory Dump. After that, click on OK. Then it will ask to restart your computer, so just click on OK to restart it. After you restarted your computer, if the last solution didn't work, then try the next one. Next, we need to optimize Roblox Player. So to do that, right-click on Roblox Player on your desktop, then click on Properties. On the top, click on Compatibility tab and make sure to check this option. Run this program in compatibility mode for Windows 8. After that, check Disable Full Screen Optimization and run this program as Administrator. Once you're done, click on Apply and OK. Open up your search bar and type in there Present Local App Data Present and hit Enter. In here, look for Temp Folder and open it up. Then find Roblox folder and delete it. You don't need to worry, it's not going to affect your account or games. So after you deleted the Roblox folder, then open up your search bar and type in there add or remove programs. In here in the search bar, type Roblox. So in here we need to uninstall Roblox player only. You don't need to uninstall Roblox, you can just leave this one. Once you uninstall it, then try to log into your Roblox account and download it again. So select any game. Then click on download and install Roblox. Click on Roblox Player Launcher to run it. And next, on your keyboard, press Windows key and R to open up run. And type in there, present local app data, present and click OK. In here, look for Roblox folder and open it up. Next, open up versions folder. Versions folder again. Look for Roblox player launcher and double click on it to run it. This should resolve the issue. After restarting your computer, log into your account and try. Hopefully, it should be working fine. And that's all. By the way, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please consider supporting me and subscribing for more videos. Thanks for watching.